Okay, we're at South Mountain Range today. It's Wednesday, 12 October. Uh, this is the video we, Andy and myself, said we would do for you. We've got a SOCOM 16 here with, <coughs> with our, <coughs> excuse me, with our Wintech, Wintalker suppressor on it. It's a gun we totally went through, but I've went through that before on this gun. So, Andy's got some 168 grain Hornadays in here. We're shooting a 200 yard gong with a suppressor. We're going to then switch to subsonic, and then we're going to Turn the spindle valve off with subsonic so you can see what happens with the gas turned off. Okay, Andy, anytime you're ready. 200 yard gone. Nailed it. Nailed it again. Outstanding. Yep. There you go. Now, you didn't feel much blowback in your face, did you? No. So there's some guys whine and cry about that. But, hey, you're going to shoot suppressed, you got to put your biggie boy pants on, okay? Now we've got the Ingle Ballistics in here, the 180-grain uh, Ingle Ballistics. And, uh, by the way, um, the uh, we're shooting under an over overhang here, so it kind of, you know, echoes pretty bad. But let's see what the subsonic does. Anytime you're ready, Andy. 200 yards still going out there. There you go. Barely hear it, can you? Barely hear it. You can see the bolt move just a little bit. That's it. You're done. Almost done. Okay, now we're going to turn the spindle valve off. So you can see how that's going to react. If we can get it to turn. stiff in there from brand new. Uh, working on it. There we go. Yeah, we're having a little trouble with it. There you go. Our spindle valves and our systems fit fairly snug. Um, had a little carbon and it might have built up at all. Okay, spindle valve is turned off. You can see the screw slot head is horizontal. Okay, anytime you're ready, Andy. So even with the gas turned off, it's not operating the action. Just like we knew it would, but we wanted to show you this uh, so there's no more question as to whether this is going to work. It's just going below the steel dong at 200. He got it on that one. Just below it a little bit. up a couple clicks he'd nail it but we're, we're just here to show you how this is working yeah there we go so there you have it um, we're gonna try to do the muzzle break I did the other day on the same uh, SOCOM 16 so that's that subsonic ammo you could you, you could probably could barely hear it and uh, 200 yards if he come up we're just out here to to show the function, but if he came up maybe three or four clicks, he'd been nailing that steel gong at 200 easily. Okay, folks, there you have it. Thanks, Andy.